Snake. Snake! Medic! She's rigged. Damn it, we were set up! We gotta get it out. No time for anesthetic. We have to open her now. Hold her down. Hold her down! Keep her gun in.
a smoke screen. I heard explosions. Then they played us like a damn fiddle. Give it back. This isn't right. That was ours. We built it. Damn it. Bitch! Come on, start talking, bitch! Come on, get up and start talking! Bob, there's... It's all right, we got it out. Your favorite song, Nicola Bart. Immigrants wrongly executed, but their deaths served as a message to others. That ours is a society that murders the innocent. Do you too believe your sacrifice will change the world? So that'll be Metal Gear Solid 5 Ground Zeroes. I knew it was going to be a shorter game, but it's only a prologue to the full game. Metal Gear Solid 5 The Phantom Pain, which I am super excited to play. Cannot wait till it comes out, and I believe August is when it's supposed to come out. I do apologize for my pretty slightly poor performance in this game. I am not great at stealth, but uh, I don't think I did as bad as I thought I was going to do, but I definitely didn't do great, so if that infuriated you, I apologize, and uh, there's more singing music in the background, but uh, uh, I actually really enjoyed this game. Uh, for those of you who are Metal Gear Solid fans, I would highly recommend getting this. It is short. It seemed like there was a few side stuff you could do, but uh, and I don't even think I discovered all the side stuff you could do, but it seems like there's some side stuff you can do, and this game is only a prologue to the full Metal Gear Solid 5 game, The Phantom Pain, that uh, I think is going to be awesome. So the game is not very long. I guess this game was mainly just serving as a prologue and kind of a introduction to introduce you to the new mechanics of the game and stuff like that, so you will be slightly ready when the full game comes out, and I believe what they said was August, but I really enjoyed this game. I'm actually going to play it several times just uh, so I can... Because I actually had a, a lot of fun playing this, and I, I really want to play it again, so... 
I will try and, and I want to get better at it to be honest with you uh, I don't feel like I did as great of a job but like I explained before in games like this where they want you to play somewhat stealthy uh, I do try to I do try to play it stealthy and if I feel like I can do it stealthy but I just you know kind of fuck up due to my own stupidity I will take death over a firefight just because that'll take me back to you know the checkpoint and I could try again because if I can play it stealthy and I feel like and I feel like I can I would rather play it stealthy which is why what two or three times in this game I took death over a firefight so and the ending got kind of shaky there um, I kind of had the viewpoint where I should clear out the area first before I move on with this you know with the pause on my shoulders but um, that didn't turn out to be the best way to do things in that scenario to be honest with you because um, actually the, the, the guards actually ended up going back and discovering that she was not there so um, I should have just kept going and not set her down and move ahead and try to clear out the area but uh, overall uh, I had a lot of fun with this and uh, it looked and played fantastic on the PlayStation 4 uh, I assume it would do just the same on the Xbox one uh, but I myself do prefer the PlayStation 4 a little bit over the Xbox one so uh, I really wanted to get it on the PlayStation 4. And plus, it's Metal Gear Solid. I mean, it belongs on the PlayStation. I'm sorry, but it, Metal Gear belongs on the PlayStation and deserves to be played on the PlayStation. I'm glad, you know, I'm glad that Xbox One and, you know, Xbox 360 got this game. Just because, I mean, the Metal Gear games are works of art. And deserve to be played by everybody but I mean to get the I wanted to play it on PlayStation 4 to get the true Metal Gear experience and that was pretty much my reasoning behind that decision um, but I had, a, I had a lot of fun playing this game I'm gonna play it several more times just because I, I did have a lot of fun with it and I do want to get better at it so but I'm glad I took the time to play this game. I think it took me a little over an hour to play the game. But, uh, you know, I like taking my time. I didn't want to rush through it or anything like that, so... I, I had a lot of fun playing it. I am glad that Metal Gear Solid V Ground Zeroes is on my... my rack over there. My game shelf thing, along with all my other games So I felt that this is a very good purchase and just makes me that much more excited for the full game to come out and uh, I hope you guys enjoyed I do apologize for my not so great stealthy abilities and whatnot. usually what happens is every time I play a stealth game I'm not careful enough I tend to uh, I try to be careful but I'm not careful enough if that makes any sense but, uh, I, I do want to get better at this, at this game, so hopefully it'll make me a little bit better at the, the Phantom Pain when that comes out. And, yep. So, I hope you guys enjoyed Metal, Metal Gear Solid V Ground Zeroes. I had a fun time. I had a very fun time playing this game, actually. It was very fun. And again, I apologize if I uh, wasn't playing it to your to your liking, I guess. But uh, I tried to do it stealthy for the most part. Uh, I tried my best. I apologize if you did not like that, but oh well. There's not much I can do about that. But uh, I try. I tried to play it stealthy to the best of my ability. And and I thought I did it. Cypher's been in okay hiding ever job, since his grand experiment. No one's seen him in years. 
All we hear are orders delivered by proxy. Except you. You met with him, face to face, in order to contact Big Boss. Tell me where he is. Where is Cypher? Where is Zero? I've never known choice. Where I was born, the language I speak, I've never had the freedom to choose for myself. But you, right now, are free. Do as you will. This will save Big Boss. It may. Will you really kill Zero for me? Not for you. Uh, all right. Zero is... Cliffhanger. Of course. But you guys can, uh... Read all this while it's scrolling. I'm gonna go ahead and read this myself. But uh, I want to thank you all for watching Metal Gear Solid 5 Ground Zeroes. I hope you all enjoyed watching this. And I hope you all will. I'll probably. I may go ahead and make. Well, maybe not. I was thinking about making it one large video, Operation Opera. But uh, I was thinking about making it one long video. But I don't think I'm gonna do that. I think I'm just gonna separate it into multiple videos. And. Uh, I hope you all enjoyed, and I hope you all leave a lot of support on these videos. And, uh, to be continued in the Phantom Pain. But, uh, I hope you all enjoyed. I hope you all show a lot of love and support for these videos. I had a fun, fun time playing this game. It was excellent, even though its length was shorter. But it is a prologue to the full game. But even still, I had a very fun time playing this game. The length. Don't you die on me, damn it! Keep me dropping. Into me now. Clear. What's going on? Don't tell me the snake is dying. No response. Hit him again. I'm guessing this may be like a trailer for the Phantom Pain or something. Are we in England? The UK? Oh, what the fuck? You've been in a coma for quite some time. Yes, yes, I know. You would like to know how long. I'm afraid it's been... nine years. Oh, oh shit. I'm still here. Just to suffer. The body I've lost. The comrades I've lost. I won't stop hurting. Nine years, huh? Holy crap. Man, I am excited to play that. Fastest marking of all enemies trial has been unlocked for this mission's normal difficulty setting. For details, go to the trial records menu. I'm kind of, uh... This game only had a normal and hard mode. I couldn't play on hard mode. I don't know why I couldn't even switch, but I played on normal... It didn't have an easy mode. I wonder if the Phantom Pain is going to have an easy mode. I kind of doubt it, but oh well. Uh, rank C, clear reward. You have obtained the... Oh, I remember that SMG. I think that was in the back of that truck. It will be placed at this mission's start point from now on. Alright, I've obtained a rocket launcher. Chico's tape. Hard difficulty has been unlocked. Eliminate the Renegade Threat side op has been unlocked. 
Ooh, man, I got 23 rewards. Intel Operative Rescue, Side Op has been unlocked. Classified Intel Acquisition. Destroy the anti-air emplacements. Oh wait, I got 10. I guess there's 23 you can get total. I got 10. It's not bad, I guess. Well, I guess that'll be the end of that. That was an awesome... Man, I can't wait for the Phantom Pain. It's gonna be awesome. But, uh... Holy shit. Completion ratio, 10%. And it looks like he is beaten up. Look at him. Man, I like this main menu. But, uh, that'll be the end of that. I hope you all enjoyed Metal Gear Solid V Ground Zeroes. I had a very fun time playing this game. I'm gonna go back and play some more. But thank you all for watching. I apologize if I didn't play this game exactly to your liking. I tried to be as stealthy as possible. And I think for the most part I did it okay. I could have done better if I was just a little more careful. But overall I think I did okay. But thank you all for watching. I hope you all really enjoyed watching this. And I hope you all show these videos a lot of love and support. And I want to thank you all for the love and support this year in 2014. It has been awesome. I love you all. And I will see you guys on the next game. And hopefully I will see you all in the future for the Phantom Pain. I will see you all next time. I am out.